guys and welcome back to my channel so welcome to my first week of vlogmas if you have seen my video before this or if you follow me on instagram you've probably heard that i'm going to be doing vlogmas but i'm not doing a vlog every single day i'm doing one vlog for each week in december on today's agenda i'm actually going with alexis to get my nails done because i've had these nails for well over a month and they are well overdue like they look horrible they're so grown out and some of them literally have holes in them like what is happening again to explain in a little bit more depth what i'm doing for vlogmas is i'm basically vlogging each week of december just kind of what i'm doing every single day it's not really holiday themed it's just basically like what i'm doing around christmas time i guess and i just wanted to kind of try out vlogging so i think vlogmas is a perfect way to try it out I filmed a few vlogs before on my channel, but I've never really taken it seriously. So this is my way to kind of see how you guys like me vlogging on my channel and to see how I like it. And if you guys end up liking them, I'll start filming more vlogs and posting them. Now time to go and pick up Alexis. Before we get into the rest of the vlog, I just wanted to share something super quickly with you guys. So I actually get a lot of questions on how I get my hair super straight and how I make it last for a long time and how I get my hair nice and wavy and curly all the time and it's actually because I've been using this straightener right here a lot of people pronounce it differently it says the name right here I think it's Kaposi but a lot of people pronounce it differently but basically this is a straightener that I have gotten recently and it has a lot of cool features and stuff and I just love to use it the thing I like most about it is it's just like super good for your hair it has titanium plates which if you guys know that's what makes your hair super smooth and it just makes your hair healthier it doesn't really fry it or burn it as much and my favorite favorite part about it is it is actually a straightener and a curler in one and as you can tell it kind of has rounded like plates right here so that is what actually curls your hair and why I like that so much is because it's just so much easier for transportation and stuff like that like I don't want to have to pack a straightener and a curler like why can't I just have one device that does both it's like watch if I make the temperature go down it literally like counts like it says the exact temperature like while it's going it's heating up and i also like the big range of temperatures it goes from 250 degrees to 450 degrees which is perfect because all people have different hair types and all people need different heat even sometimes i like to use different temperatures every day just because my hair literally reacts differently every day like today it's almost straight which is kind of surprising but usually it's like super wavy but right now it's really frizzy and this straightener helps like not getting it super frizzy so i love that too i love how the straightener just goes through my hair like so smoothly because with other straighteners sometimes I can literally hear just like pieces of hair getting ripped out of my head but with the straightener I don't hear that also sometimes I can literally hear like burning or see like smoke coming off like that is just not something I want to see happening to my hair usually it takes me so long to straighten my hair and I just did this side of my hair and literally like five minutes no joke I actually almost forgot to mention this and I'm actually really surprised because I've been telling my friends about this and it's always the first feature that I mentioned so when you like leave this on or like you leave your house like you know what I mean and you accidentally leave this on it has like auto shut off so it shuts off after like a period of time but I can't explain to you how many straighteners I've left on and stuff and then like I remember like 30 minutes later and I have to like text my brother like can you please go turn it off because I literally like forget and stuff so I love that feature so much just because it prevents my house from burning down and just so many other bad things that could literally happen. I just got finished and look at how straight my hair is. I think this is like the longest my hair has ever looked and I just love how like perfectly straight it looks and how smooth it is. If you guys like this product, please click the link in my description below to go to Amazon to purchase it. It's actually Amazon Prime, which you know means you can get it super fast. And if you guys can't think of things to get someone as a Christmas gift, this is the perfect gift and since it is Amazon Prime it'll be here in no time so you have lots of time to order this. So make sure you click the link in the description now to order your Kapuzi straightening iron now. I just got in my car and it is literally freezing outside like holy crap this is the first time I actually decided to wear like a winter coat just because it's like so cold out right now it's 38 degrees and I'm actually very mad because my car has been so dirty for like probably a month now and I decided like to push off cleaning it and now it's winter and it's going to be horrible to come out here and clean my car while it's 38 degrees outside so that's a decision that I regret. <laughs> I picked up Alexis and we're at the nail place so 
just to show you a before and after, Alexis has to show you what her nails look like. There's Alexis's. Hers aren't as bad as mine. Mine, are so bad. <laughs> mine have, oh. Uh, yeah, that happened on both of them. I saw that um, yesterday you Snapchatted me that and it just looks like you have like a French tip on one of them. Doesn't my hair look really dark? Yeah, I like it though. That orange was getting kind of gross. We just got back in the car and we both did white actually. I'll show mine first. Here's mine. It was a quite very fast experience. What time did we even get here? Probably three. I have no idea. It took like 50, 40 something minutes like in between there and he cut my finger actually and I'm not mad though because my nails turned out pretty good and like we were saying white nails are really hard to do good so right now we're going to go get some bubble tea my mom's actually going to a different bubble tea place but we're going to balance to get bubble tea so see you guys there remember what I wore on the first day of school in first grade for like no reason I remember second grade I wore a uh, shirt with a bow on it. Got our bubble tea. We both ended up getting some something different. This is a milk tea. It's um, what is it called? Strawberry milk tea? Strawberry cream. Strawberry cream milk tea. And then I got strawberry bubbles and she got blueberry. And we both got Oreos in it, which and sounds honey disgusting. In it. There's honey in this? Yeah. Okay, ready? I feel like we won't be able to taste it though. Have you ever got milk tea? It's actually like good. I feel like there's the like Oreos a, are weird, but yeah, like it's like good. Yeah, there's like a really sweet taste though, and I don't know where it's coming from. Honey, <laughs> is that what it is? I don't taste it. I like it. I like it. It's actually really good. I this slaps. Oh, I do like it. I give it an 11 out of 10. Really? I give it an 8 out of 10. Just because I always think there's something there that I would like better. Well, I thought I would film really quickly before I go to bed. Um, I am freaking out inside right now because I have so much to do in so little time. And I already tried to get ahead of my homework tomorrow. But it's 1.50 a.m. and I literally just can't stay awake one second longer. And since I stayed up so late, I'm gonna wake up later tomorrow. So either way, I would have had the same time to do my homework, if that makes sense. But basically tomorrow I have to finish filming this Amazon video thing and I have to vacuum like the whole house. And I have to do all of my homework and on top of that I have dance at like five or something six maybe I don't know but as you guys can tell I'm just really stressed and I have so much work that literally came from like nowhere like I don't know where it came from and I'm just like so stressed out like oh my gosh and today I waited and did my homework after I got my nails done but I did most of my homework before so it didn't really matter so I got all of that done so it wasn't that big of a deal but I don't even know I'm just so tired right now so I'll probably talk to you guys tomorrow or I might not even have time to speak to you guys tomorrow it is December 3rd, basically December 4th, because it is 12.06 a.m. Basically, I just wanted to share with you guys this little cute face care package thing that I got sent. A lot of like YouTubers and influencers have been getting sent this as well, so I decided to kind of open it up. To be honest with you guys, I rarely use like face products. The main thing that I use every single day is moisturizer, and I don't really use like acne wash and stuff like that because I feel like it makes my skin 10 times worse get this stuff like this is like so cute here's a gel cleanser which honestly I've never used a gel cleanser before but I'm kind of intrigued and here's the moisturizer which I'm going to show you in a second because it was awesome and this is a refreshing toner which I also use this it's like a spray this is makeup remover which I'm interested to use this too because usually I only use like the um wipes so i used the balancing moisturizer and basically i was so confused i was like trying to pick off like this little thing because i thought it was like the cap so you push this thing down and it like comes out the like top like watch like oh my gosh and then you just like scoop it with your finger and look it's like perfectly clean and it doesn't get everywhere hey guys so it is carly we are in the tim hortons drive-thru alexis is driving a sports car <laughs> and it's kind of cool not gonna lie but anyway we are at 
I already said that. It is 12 p.m. right now, which honestly it feels earlier but later at the same time. Thank you. So we just got our food. So I got a small Oreo ice cap. It was kind of very last minute because I didn't have time to prepare what I wanted. And Alexis got, what is that? A mixed berry smoothie. Then we both got the same donut, which Christmas. it's a Christmas donut. We got these little sprinkled vanilla dip donuts. And last time when we came here, it was like around Thanksgiving and the donuts were yellow and orange and white. So they change it up every season. Well, hey guys, I'm back home and I keep making the mistake of having dairy like over and over again, even though I'm lactose intolerant and it hurts like so bad my stomach. It's like literally horrible. I get worse like stomach cramps from having dairy than I do like period cramps. Sorry, that's like TMI, but it's true. So I take baths like 24 seven just because they make me feel better. So right now I just made my little bath. The water's not filled up all the way yet, but I stopped it so I could film it. But I lit this candle, it's called Cinnamon Bun. It's literally my favorite candle of all time. I got it from Target and it's amazing. I literally light it so much and I have so many candles, but I always go back to this one. And I brought my computer in there because currently I am watching Gossip Girl. And if you guys know, they are removing Gossip Girl from Netflix December 31st. And I'm only on season two and there's six seasons and they all have like 20 episodes that are 45 minutes long. And I've been watching it for like maybe a week and a half now or maybe two weeks. And I'm only on season two like episode 14 or something like that so I have a lot of work to do and it is already December 5th like I have like 26 days or something like that and that's like barely any time so I like try to watch at least two three episodes a day so I'm gonna sit in my bath for probably a long time and watch a few episodes and I'll update you guys when I get out so hey guys I'm in my car right now but I'm actually in my garage and it is so cold in here so there's actually a heater in here so hopefully it warms up a little bit faster but i just had the garage open to pull my car in here so it's really cold but basically what i'm doing is cleaning out my car because this is like long overdue i should have done this a very long time ago but instead i waited till winter and also i'm wearing shorts which is a horrible idea but my car isn't horribly dirty. It just needs like vacuumed and like you can see there's lots of leaves on the ground and just some stuff in here. There's some stuff over there. Back here isn't too bad, but basically what I'm doing is just cleaning it up like that has fingerprints all over it. But I also need to clean the outside of my car, but I would just do that by going through a car wash. But I'm not going to do that today. I'm going to wait and do that another day, but... Today we're just cleaning the inside, which is the more important part. So I'll film a little after for you guys. I actually just finished. It took me probably, I'll tell you exactly how long it took me because I called my dad around 12.45 and it is 2.45. So it probably took me an hour and a half, I would say, which is kind of a long time, but it was really messy and now it's really clean, so I'm not mad. I just sprayed some stuff in here to make it smell a little bit better, so it's kind of like still a little wet in some spots. But basically, I vacuumed the floor. That is still a little bit damp because I washed it. And then this is all clean, and here is all clean. I actually switched out my little trees thing. Hopefully, I get a little bit more cute car stuff for Christmas. I asked for some stuff to put on that. And then coming back here, Everything is nice and clean and I have this little basket here. I decided to make this one just like a bin and then In my trunk I have a blanket in this bin So I decided the one in the trunk can be the garbage bin because it's kind of gross to have You know a bin of trash just in the open right here. This is all super clean in here I just keep my chargers and stuff and then in here I keep you know Hand stuff, hand sanitizer, hand lotion, chapstick. My favorite part is my scent. Whenever someone's in my car and they see that, they are always like, oh my God, that's so cool. <laughs> just cause I like to keep it organized. But down here is pretty organized too. I just have a few little things like a lint roller, gum, mint, whatever. I'm very excited because it finally smells good in here for the longest time. It just smelled like, a lot of people described it as like old grandpa, but 
that's not really like a smell I guess you would say but for the longest time it just had like this really weird smell and I didn't know how to get rid of it and I had this little tree thing in here it was like a black one and maybe it just didn't like smell good or something because for some reason like the smell in here was not going away and this is strawberry and I can already smell like a difference like it already smells better my car is finally back at its parking spot it looks amazing I've been dreading doing this for a very long time now but I finally got it done and I feel so much better but I also have 20 miles left in my car till it's empty I need to get gas and I need to go through a car wash so maybe that will be a part of my next vlogmas video so hey guys, I am back in my room after I got done cleaning my car. I went and got food with my mom, which was many hours ago. I came home and took a bath and then I started my homework because today I decided to hold my homework off until later in the day just because I wasn't really having a good morning because I started to do school and then it went badly. So I just decided to do it later in the day. So. I finished all my homework, well basically, not really, but it's 10 o'clock and I'm about to edit this video and then I'm going to do a quick little thing that I have to do for a Zoom meeting tomorrow. That's why I said I wasn't completely done with my homework. Oh, I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I tried to incorporate like a lot of different things. I kind of do the same thing every day and repeat, like I take a lot of baths, like I take a bath every day, but I think I only filmed one, which is pretty good. I'm surprised I didn't end up filming more and then everything else wasn't really a repeat I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and if you like the way I kind of organized it let me know because then I'll make the next video like that so make sure you give this video a thumbs up and give me some ideas of some Christmassy things maybe that you guys want me to do in the next vlog so thank you for watching vlogmas week one video and I'll see you guys in the next vlogmas video bye